Today's video, let's check it out. Uh, I see you all the time. Are you following me? I'm going to get a restraining order. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so here this is tonight. This was filmed about 30 minutes ago uh, at the tour down under South Australia. We've got Adelaide gone. We've got Peter Sagan. There's a new bike here. There's a new bike. Because if you could spot it, we've got the Venge. We've got the Tarmac. And there's Jay there on a an LA. He's skidding there, locking it up in this style. So this is a team presentation, and uh, we have seen three different bikes and specialised, and the team, there's no options for them. They're only allowed to run disc brake bikes. If you were a pro, if you were a professional and you had to ride only disc, what would you think? I guess if you're a GC rider, you might be thinking, hmm, I'm not sure how this is going to go for wheel changes and stuff. But... We are seeing the disc brake bikes getting pushed pretty hard, and I think disc brakes are good, and I think they're bad. I think they're an option, but uh, Specialized are really pushing them hardcore. And if you look at sales, the old disc tarmac, they sold nothing, really, compared to what they're selling now. So I'll see a lot of tarmac discs and benches out the road there. Daniel Oss rode with Uncle Chester yesterday. He's on the, uh, that's the venge right there. That's a big boy venge. The Roval, and this is the LA Sprint. Look at that. That's not a bad color. I, I could dig that. It's like an old 1994 Avanti Aggressor. Anodized, sort of green. It looks like that. It's the DSW uh, Smart World. Named up on the Specialized employees there. So we are talking the DI2 Dura Ace 9100. Well, it looks like there's a, that seat post looks... Alarmingly like the one they use in the bench. And the fork looks, for me, identical to what you see in the tarmac. I could be wrong, but that looks really, really suspicious. It looks like a tarmac fork. Tarmac fork. It was all over the tarmac there with a, uh, a bench seat post. I could be wrong. If someone in, in the comment section is below, let me know. But this is an LA. It looks, a little, I guess, is it a little bit different? Having a tarmac fork and a bench seat post potentially? Is this a different LA? LA was one of uh, Specialized's first road bikes. I think the Epic was their first ever road bike. The, the Carbon Epic back in the day. And it looks like Jay's had a, a recent crash. With his skin lost on there. So that's the close-up there. The first on YouTube, apparently. And uh, this is uh, the, uh, the rider presentation. Disc brake bikes for crits. I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of that yet. But uh, I do have a few disc brake bikes. And uh, they're great in the wet. They're great in the wet. Could be a good uh, messenger bite in the disc brakes. This here is the Venge. And a nice, interesting paint job there. The black and the green. What do you think? What do you think of that paint job, bro? What do you think of that? And they, are they tubulars or singles? They look like... Uh, they look like tubulars to me. But yeah, so that is the Venge there, fork. Interesting colours, they've got a ceramic bottom bracket, and they're not running the BB30. What sort of bottom bracket is in there? What sort of bottom bracket is that in there? And this is, uh, it looks like Daniel Oss, big OSS, oversized stock, is Daniel Oss. Tax drink bottles, the S Works sticker on there, Peter Sagan, it's taken selfies with a lot of fans, and he was very, very approachable. Even ask Uncle Chester. Ask Uncle Chester, what would it be like to be a teammate on Peter Sagan's team? And people walk straight past you and say, can I get a photo of Pete? What happens? Is there any like a little bit of jealousy going on? Or, or the team guys just understand that? What's the deal? Everyone, everyone wants a slice of Sagan. Is there enough of Sagan to go around? Does it cause any conflicts on the team? You're just getting totally ignored if you're a teammate, potentially. And everyone's just all after, all after Pete. It is interesting, uh, interesting dynamic. Anyway, that's the Specialized bike, always pr producing something interesting. Share your thoughts, comments down below. So welcome to my we'll channel. We'll see you tuning in under. My name's Duran Rider. This is my friend Nippers here. I'm helping him cross the road. He's down in his training run this morning as we get lost. 